Hey, 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 Gemini. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your Wednesday, May 20th to the 21st, Intuitive Love Tarot Read. This is for my Geminians, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, in North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Geminis. Before you leave, I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. Also, don't forget to comment. Let me know if this resonates with you. I want to hear from you guys. All right, Geminis. If you guys yeah, are interested in a personal reading with me, the information is in the description box below. Let's see what we got here, Gemini. I'm going to grab one more card and then get a channeled message from Spirit just for you. Okay, at the bottom of the deck, we have the Three of Wands. Waiting, huh? All right, let's get this message before we begin. I just heard coming out of the dark. Mm, stand up, Gemini. They're saying stand up and be proud. And they just keep saying seek, seek. It's like you're, they're wanting you to look for something. Yeah? Okay, they, they, they're they saying they don't want to tell you what it is, but it, it's in relation to your dreams, which is coming up a lot lately for people. Hmm. Not, okay, not dream world dreams. I'm talking about like your dreams of this world. What do you want to manifest? So they're saying seek. Okay. What are you waiting for? Huh? What are you waiting for? Your ships to come in? They're coming. They're always coming. All right. So let's see. You got temperance over the moon and the ten of pentacles. Okay. All right. Patience is needed here, Gemini. Because I feel your abundance is like hidden from you. And you're hiding it from yourself. Because it's like you know how to get there. You, and this is why spirit doesn't want you, it doesn't want to tell you what it is. Because you, you have the ability to find it. It's like it's already there. It's just a matter of you accessing it via your intuition. Okay? Because your abundance, your happiness is here. But you may have to get through some healing. There's something you haven't healed from. This is Sagittarius. But this is also talking about embracing change. So if there are changes happening in your life right now. Oops. Sorry, Ted. If there's changes happening in your life right now, Gemini, try to embrace them. And know that um, it's not the end. Everything's always changing, right? So appreciate what is, what, what has changed, and what is there to appreciate around you. All right. Tell me about this temperance. Yeah. See how he's looking at the pentacle? It's like he's studying the pentacle. I feel like you need to study your surroundings and really look, okay? Um, no matter how they look to you. Like, if, if you were to just flash, you know, look quickly. Um, don't go by first impressions, I'm, I'm hearing. It's like, look deeper. Look deeper. Because there are more layers to what is changing around you and why. Interesting. Yeah, Four of Swords. So, really think about this. It, it's... What I'm feeling is it's very simplistic. 
But we complicate shit, man. We really do. <laughs> All right, tell me about this Nine of Cups. You, yeah, see, this is your wishes and your dreams. It's like they're right there. Nine of Swords. This is clarifying your Nine of Cups. And the Queen of Wands. So you've got clarifying the Nine of Cups, which is the wish card, which is the um, self-indulgence, right? Nine of Swords and Queen of Wands. It's like you're going after your dreams, but you're scared. You're anxious. You're... you're something's bothering you and you've got to get to the bottom of it that's that that's it it's enough gemini all right tell me about this five of cups okay the five of cups is clarified by the two of pentacles you're trying to balance your emotions clarify this again okay um a page of cups they're saying, if you're waiting for an apology, stop waiting. Stop waiting. You deserve to move ahead. And don't even, you don't need it. You don't need it. Okay? Lesson learned, Gemini, from whatever this Five of Cups situation was. Okay, this, this energy doesn't serve you when it comes up. I don't feel like you're in this energy all the time. Okay, but it does pop up. We're human, right? So just being aware of that and noticing that and saying, nope, I deserve to move on from it, okay? Um, apologize to yourself for putting yourself in this situation when it comes up and say, no. The gift I'm going to give myself is I'm moving on, okay? All right, so anybody coming towards you in love? I'd like to know that. Let's see. Ooh, possible Leo. We have the Sun card. Okay, somebody who's emotionally vulnerable, I'm feeling. Somebody who, it's like, I feel like when you meet this person, it's going to be like a fresh new beginning for you. Eight of Swords. Yeah, this state, okay, this mental imprisonment, I almost feel like this energy is going to free you from it. Because it's going to be so refreshing. It's going to, it's like it triggers something within you that allows you to see. It's a prison of your own making, but just by the mere presence, I'm feeling, of this person, it's like they something about their energy triggers something inside you that allows you to get the key and free yourself. Or get the scissors, right? And see. Yep. Queen of Swords. Yeah, it's like you're clear now. You see. It makes sense. This person is very intelligent as well. So you'll find them humorous. I think you'll have a lot of fun with them. A lot of fun times. You're going to feel like a child again, Gemini. Doesn't matter how old you are. You're going to feel very youthful and open-hearted. And they're going to make it okay for you to be open-hearted. They're going to make it okay for you to be emotionally vulnerable. It's going to be very easy to trust this person. Even if you have trust issues, they're saying, this, this, this is different. And you're going to find that quite amazing. No more lack mentality for you. It's like this person is your magic antidote to this five energy here. See? And then it's funny. They're the antidote... And they, ha they come up as the Ten of Cups. So it's like they're the Ten. They stomp on your fives and they create emotional fulfillment for you. Well, not for you, but with you, right? This is your happiness. This is your forever. That's what I'm feeling. Could be a twin with the Four of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Let's get some advice here. Advice. Don't miss this opportunity when it comes up. That's why when you're in this five of uh, cups state, you got to snap yourself out of it because you don't want to be in this state. And then this, this person comes along and because you're in that state, you just miss it because you're looking down instead of up. Advice. Yep. Emperor and the 10 of swords. Well, 
That just sums it up. You need to let go of this betrayal, backstabbing, lying. Whatever happened in the past doesn't matter anymore. It's in the past. Don't they say that in The Lion King? Right? I forget who says it. But the emperor knows what he wants, right? They're like, focus on what you want. This is their advice. You are the emperor. You know you can get what you want. So just go get it. They just said, yes, it is as simple as that. High priestess. Now, when it comes to manifestation and this person, when you meet this person and you start talking to them, don't tell anybody. Not yet. Wait till, um, wait a while. Enjoy it. Enjoy the manifestation, the slow manifestation, the evolvement of this relationship because it's very sweet. I can feel it. Okay? So listen to your intuition. All right? And right under the high priestess, oh my God, is the fool. You can take a leap of faith with this person. No worries there. All right, Gemini, I hope this resonated with you. I hope it helped. Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading with me, that way this is more specific to you and your needs, the info is in the description box below. Have yourself a fabulous day, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.